All right, in this video, I want to show you how to use the Keepa um, tracking feature. So this is for affiliates. A lot of times you're going to get a lot of the same items or the same products constantly go on deal like every month or every couple of months or whatever. Um, you don't want to do a search for that. You want to set something up automatic. So I'm going to show you how to do that within this Keepa program. And I think, I'm not sure, but I think you can do it with the free version, but I'm not positive. So maybe you can tell me if you have experience, um, which one you have to have. But I have the paid version. It's around 20 to $22 a month. So it's pretty reasonable if you're doing any sort of affiliate marketing. Okay, so here's how this works. Um, you, I'm assuming you've downloaded the Keepa plugin and it's actually working on Chrome. So you go to Amazon, just like you see on the screen. Uh, I'm in a woodworking niche. So I'm gonna say, let's look up saw blades, right? So I've got these saw blades. And I think I want to keep track of this to see when the price drops. See, currently uh, we're at $76 and I want to know when this thing drops to a certain amount so that then I can make an affiliate link and push it to my group. So this is the Keepa plugin. This is the data it shows you. But what I'm interested in this video is this track product feature. So I'm going to click on track product and within Keepa, it will give me several different options. So what, the thing I like about Keepa is it allows me to choose when do I get a notification. So I click on the buy box and it will say the current price is $76.13. Now, the lowest price has been $74.99 and then you can see the rest of them here. So uh, this is where you get a you get a kind of pick which one you're looking for. So you know, the lowest in three months, you know, is probably about their low number on this particular listing. So I'll click lowest in three months. Okay. I come down here. There are some other options you can choose. You can say shipped and sold by Amazon only. Um, you can do new, any new. Okay. Um, and then you can say how long you want to track the item for. Uh, I just choose 10 years because I don't want to come back and mess with it. And then you hit start tracking. Now, when you hit start tracking, it will give you all sorts of notification options that you can set up. So email, telegram, web uh, that you can do. Now, what I like best right here is it says get notified via email of upcoming lightning deals 24 hours in advance for this particular product. So that's automatically checked and I get a notification when it starts. And then if it will reset that timer for seven days, I can see. Yeah, you can choose one day, you know, these sellers don't put a lightning deal on, um, you know, that often so that that timer resets. So there you go. So now that's automatically done for me. So let's go into Keepa and I can see where these are tracked. So within the Keepa program, I can hit track and I can hit tracking overview. Now you're going to see a whole bunch of items that I have tracked here. And this is what it will show you. So um, these are the items that I have selected. There's an apron, there's some markers, um, there's some shims. And this little check mark is fantastic because that check mark tells me that I've met the criteria for what it is that I set up there. So this particular item is a check mark green, check mark, check mark, you know, all the way down. So at a quick glance, I can see if this is getting what I want. Then you have all the other Keepa data here where you can find the current price, the uh, desired price. So like the reason why this is a check is because the current price is $7.98. My desired price was $9.38, so it's on a sale and it has a green check. And then I can sort this right there. Okay, so this particular item is 17% above my desired price. So if I sort it again, all right, let's see here. Let's do that again. Oh, sorry. Okay, if I sort that, nah, let's see, why did it not do that? Okay, there we go. So these are the ones that are sorted to my desire or that are under my desired price, right? So they're negative. So it's more of a savings than I, I was looking for. Um, and then, <clears throat> so that's the first thing about the keep a wish list kind of thing. Now, the other thing is the notification. Oh, I'm sorry, forgot about this part up here. <clears throat> this 
tells you what's currently on lightning deal of the ones that I have in my wish list. So these mag these magnets are on lightning deal. Currently it's eight dollars and thirty nine cents was the lightning deal price. If I click on this, it will tell me uh yeah so normally they're nine dollars and thirty nine it's currently a lightning deal at 839 so i can choose what to do with that information um okay so the other part is the notifications i automatically have the notifications to go to my gmail account um, and then within my gmail account i've set up a specific label so that anything that comes in from keepa.com with the tag price alert gets filtered into this file for me. So in the morning when I post my deals, I'll come in here, I'll open up this folder, I'll sort through the last couple hours of whatever came in, I'll determine what I want to post, what I don't want to post, and it gives me a quick little glance as to what is on sale based on the parameters that I put in. So um, very simple to use. Here's what the email will look like. It will tell you your desired price, current price, and the difference. It includes if there's a clickable coupon on the listing. And then if you don't like, let's say you set the you set the notification and it's just it's constantly notifying you, but it's not right. Well, you hit update tracking within the email. It takes you to the page and you say, OK, I don't I want to set this price different. Well, you can come in here and you can adjust the price. So very straightforward, very simple to use. Um, and there's some integration there with gmail or whatever mail system you have and keep us so i hope that was helpful for you and i will put the links like everybody else down in the description so you can check out keepa and gmail is free so that's not any sort of um, information so there you go i appreciate y'all watching and y'all have a good day thank you